What's good, everybody? It's your boy, FB Aftermath, Teron Beckham, for those who don't know. I'm just a young boy with a dollar and a dream. Now, I'm going to take you guys through my full day. I just woke up, just got dripped up, dressed, about to head to the gym to get pretty much a leg day conditioning session in. Um, for those who do not know, right now, if you've watched my last two videos, for those who do not know, I, Teron Beckham, am trying... No, I'm not trying. I am. I am in the process of becoming a professional wrestler. Now, I feel like this is something that I was meant to do out of all the things that I've done. And I've been enjoying training. And luckily for you guys, you get to see a glimpse of that training today. Now, first session will be a gym session. Like I said, we're going to go to the gym. I don't really eat before the gym. I might have a snack or something. But we're going to go in the kitchen might grab something, might not, take some pre-workout, head to the gym, get our first session in, chill for the middle of the day, and then we head to the ring later on. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, follow along, you already know what it is. Appreciate you being here. If you know how the YouTube social media game works, I'm sponsored by Alpha Line. We have some wonderful, great supplements. Sorry about that, I turned and the backlight was going and I just ended up turning into the purest of black people. But anyways, we have our Alpha Line Extreme, Great Zilla, right here. Pre workout, we have our pump, pump pills, and our muscle activators, MTORs, right here. So, if you would be so kindly to use code Aftermath at checkout, check out Alpha Line. They got a nice, they got a, a good amount of fat loss stuff as well, which is, I think they're known for like their dad bod sack. For if you're around my age and you got kids, like the majority of people around my age, some for some reason do, check out the dad bod sack. Use code Aftermath. <laughs> working hard or hardly working? I don't work, but I'm always hard. Oh. Oh. That is. All right. Oh, is that a new one? No, nah, this is my girlfriend's camera. Dang, it's what? Makes sense. You always smelling good. Yeah. You look like a carrot. All right, I'll catch up. You're like a carrot in like one of those 80s cartoons. What's up, Doc? You know how like 80s cartoons colors kind of be like a little bit like dullish? I could see that. <laughs> first workout of the day with this workout how i'm doing things it's pretty much um just something light on the days that i do my training um what i mean by that is when i have wrestling training later that day i don't want to really go in the times before um to just go crazy in the gym and then Next thing you know, I'm going in the ring later that day and beating up my body. You know what I'm saying? Cause taking those bumps, you know, all, like I, I'm feeling all that all the time. So I kind of want to go into my practices as fresh as I can. And I've had to lower down a lot of my heavy lifting. You know, I'll probably heavy lift now two to three times throughout the week. Two to three times, you know, versus almost every damn day. Um, as I'm speaking right now, I'm actually taking the day off um, that I have practiced later today. I'm taking the day off, you know, because um, I have to really focus more on mobility, movement stuff, injury prevention stuff. And I'm starting to finally realize I need to chill out on the weight room. <laughs> um, you know, as much as I take pride in my strength and stuff um there are more things there are things i can do to better myself for what i am getting ready for um but once again as you see it's a very light workout um everything was majority four sets of eight to 12 reps definitely give it a try um it was a good workout i felt very energized and very loose and you know it was it was a good workout so once again you know you see what i did uh you know do about four sets eight to twelve reps for everything and give it a try Ooh, it is hot day finish up with today's training today's training was nothing crazy as you saw just a lot of mobility like um performance type of work kind of like you know i want to say like it's like more functional nothing's really more functional but more performance based movements um i guess you would say um so you know with our a lot of landmine stuff today focus a lot of hip a lot of uh posterior chain kind of like focused stuff um for, well, worked on you know the obliques 
the stabilizers for your abs, which is very important with athletic performance and movement and, you know, back pain, comfortability and things. So that was just kind of like a light session. Majority of my sessions on days that I have training will be like today. Um, nothing crazy. I'm not like doing hella heavy weights or anything like that. It's just like very... Uh, like a very moderate type of uh, workout just so I can, you know, have majority of my en energy for the rest of the, for the, the day. Ugh. Just so I can have majority of my energy for later. So we're about to go get some food. Um, it's pretty late right now. It's 2 o'clock. I haven't eaten at all. So we are going to go to Chipotle because Chipotle is always the best option when it comes to needing something to eat very quickly. Just pulled up to the lay. I'll be right back, ladies and gentlemen. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Hey, if you know what that's from, comment down below. Now, got my Chipotle. Now, I don't know if it's just me, but I, I get a little slightly offended when I be like, all right, I want, because I get a scoop of chicken and I get a scoop of steak, right? So I get I get a scoop of both. I get, a, I get the scoop of chicken. I say uh, scoop of steak as well. That's going to be extra. No shit. Three, majority three to four days out of the week, I train fasted. So I wake up, I go to the gym. Today was one of those days. Now it is, once again, it's two o'clock. So I'm just now eating, 2.30, it's about to be 2.30. My first meal right here, right now at 2.30. I feel like it's a good balance for me. Like some days where I took like a 16 hour fast or whatever. And, and um, yeah, so like three days out of the week, I'll, I'll do a fast just to kind of Level myself out because, you know, you can just like overindulge all the time, you know, with food and just constantly, especially yesterday because yesterday was a full on snack day. Like I, I ate like one major meal yesterday and everything else was just like snacks. I'm talking like Slim Jims and Reese's and, you know, uh, peanuts and stuff like that. It was just all snacks. Majority. Like a Lunchable. I had a lot. I, forgot, I think I finished the day out with a Lunchable. Um, so this is kind of how I balance it out. You know, it wasn't a crazy high calorie day. It was a normal high calorie day yesterday, but it was just full of junk food, like, you know, macronutrients that did not support my needs. So today we'll be more on it, fasted, and getting this meal in. So I have to get this meal in and watch some anime. Is it just me or, yo, know, I do not like during the daytime. I want my room to feel like it's nighttime all day long. I do not want light to be in my room at all. It just kills my mood and it makes me sleepy. I don't know why. Darkness makes me feel like more energetic in a way. I'm get out these clothes too. All right, so let me tell you what's happened to, you know, kind of get you guys caught up. I sat here, opened my food, right? Opened my food, um, got up. Got up because I forgot my phone. Boom, all right, came back, sat down. Got up. Cause I forgot my um, fork. Went in there. Got listen to how bad my ADHD. Got caught up. I don't even know what the hell I was doing. Got caught up doing something else. Ended up coming back to the room. And here I am for a third time getting my dumbass back up to go grab the fork that I originally left this damn place to come back and have. So yeah, Kim K's booty juice is actually pretty good. From Alani New. My girl will say this. I probably like to drink more than I like to eat. Like you see all this? Gold. Like I got waters. My shaker cup. I just like to drink shit all the time. Like I just like drinking stuff. Juices. I got my Diet Dr. Pepper. I drink at least like two to three Diet Dr. Peppers a day. I told her this was a bad batch. This was not a good batch of Diet Dr. Pepper. What's y'all thoughts on this anime? Zom 100. So far, I like it. I've been bouncing back from this in the Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. I didn't know there was another Full Metal Alchemist, but somebody said I should have started with the other one first. But I didn't. So, but Zom 100, comment down below. Alright, so I got a package. They just got back from the stove. I got a package because Alpha Lead is dropping some dick pants. Okay, here. Here. Alphalese dropping some dick pants. I don't benefit from it. I'm a grower. So. <laughs> uh, Stupid. <laughs> so, uh, let me go grab those real quick. 
Alpha Leak, Alpha Line, Aftermath. I'm like a triple A battery. We got some Alpha Line teeth. Here's some simple basic teeth. Meh. It's a shirt. <laughs> it's a shirt. I mean, you don't, you don't expect much from a supplement company. And an XL. That's got some weight to it. I ain't gonna bullshit you. Don't look at me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, booty. Don't look at me. Fit nice. These are XLs on me. I am 237 pounds right now. Yeah. Leg size, what, 28? 28? 27 and a half, 28. 27 and a half, 28. Leg size, 27 and a half, 28. Calf size, doesn't matter because you ain't got them. <laughs> <laughs> nah, these are, these are cool. All right. There's a pants, a group pair, and a shorts. I believe. Mean, all of them feel nice. They feel super cool, like very cool feeling. Nice. Release them off your calves. When I put them on, they just get stuck there. <laughs> oh yeah, them is the, them is the. Them is ain't, these ain't for nothings. What are you doing? Ah. You remind me of Patrick when he had them boots on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> these, these boots was fly. <laughs> <laughs> Large would have been pretty. Like, it would have been loose, but it would have been like a tighter loose. I like this type of loose mm -hmm. right here. These a little big. This is what, the extra large? Yeah, it was an extra large. I need a medium. There you go. She wants them in her size. In a medium. In a medium. All right, so I'm about to lounge around in my new loungewear. Men's okay. loungewear. The length on them, too. Uh, going to chill until it's pretty much time to leave for uh, practice. So, yeah. Practice. <laughs> no way. So honestly, the struggling part about all this is the um, <laughs> driving. I've never drove, driven so much in my life. It's about 40 to 50 minute drive, uh, which I know a lot of people do. I'm not used to driving. The majority of my last few years, everything around me has been, you know, everything I need to go to within 10 to 15 minutes. So, you know, that's kind of how, why I move to certain areas is because I don't like to move around much and I like everything between you know, furthest 15 minutes. So there's 45 minutes drive, you know, every day or every other day or so is, it's long, but we're doing what we can right now, man. You know, gotta suck it up, do it regardless if I don't like it. You know, once again, I know there are people out there that do, you know, drive 45, 50 minutes to get to work every day. I know, that's you. I'm, I'm not used to it, that's what I'm saying. So, um, hell, 20 minutes is long to me, so. Um, so yeah, but we're about to get this drive in, and uh, uh, yeah. All right, so I just got here at the facility. They just moved in right here, so a lot of stuff is like, you know, has been cleaned off, still being dusted out. Um, they just moved out the last facility into this new one, uh, literally just recently, as you can see. So, you know, things are still, how you doing, things? Say it again? Oh uh, yeah, he's back here, I'll get him. Uh, ring, I'm still getting the lighting and stuff, and back here, got some like weight stuff, but they're moving the weight room actually out here, um, cause it's like somewhere in the back, another ring, what's good, what's good, somebody in uh, in the front asking for you, uh, oh, this is where the, uh, the next ring is gonna be, yeah. yeah, so yeah, I'm gonna get, um, let me get warmed up, man. I think one thing about me is making sure I stay warmed up, getting like the mentality of like always come in, warm up. I'm, I'm here an hour early, or hour and a half early, and I've kind of been consistently coming here an hour and a half early um, just to kind of get my mind prepared, focus on me, and uh, you know, just get a little bit of extra work in, you know, because I, you know, these guys are ahead of me, so I have to like, I feel like I have to either come here earlier or stay later. I prefer to be earlier. Um, then later, so let me pull this back. I don't know why I keep doing that. 
but this is the facility for now, and uh, yeah.
Out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I guess I'll be in gift. <laughs> I'm Rache. Hola. <laughs> How you doing? You know, that's your wrestling name? Uh, yeah. Give me your gimmick, Rache. Raquel. Raquel? Okay, got you, got you. Okay. And you've been wrestling for how long? Over 10 years. Over 10 years. <laughs> I appreciate you for being patient with me today. <laughs> Shout out to this man as well. Appreciate you being patient Appreciate with me. What's your what, what you go by? Uh, Johnny Lines. Johnny Lines. Yeah, that's the I G. The Johnny Lines. T H E J O N N Y L Y. Should O N S. Oh, oh, okay. Got you. And y'all as well. You know who you remind me of? Who? Mr. Robot. Who's Mr. Robot? You talking about the the, the show, the British show? Nah, I think Mr. Robot. So he plays. Yeah, did you see any of the Twilights? I hate those movies with a passion. I don't yeah. know who you're talking about. It's from Twilight Three. He only he was only oh, in Twilight yeah. Three or Four or whatever. The full Moon. Uh, you know, full full moon, moon. I think he had the element powers. I don't know who you're talking about. Now you gonna make me go home and look this up, bro. Oh um, yeah, Mr. Robot. Yo, you remind me of him. Yeah. I got it. Uh, he's a I got he's a, a damn good. Lord. <laughs> <laughs> what? 
<laughs> what you go by? What they what they call you? Jonathan Vega. Jonathan Vega. One member of La Familia. La Familia. La Familia is right here. Quiet. You know, hey, shout out to you. Brian Keith, baby. You know, came through first day. He said he used to watch the YouTube videos all the time. Dog. So shout out to you. All Let him know who you man. are. Bounty Hunter Brian Keith. I'm fucking here in reality wrestling, going hard, training as best way as I can. You know, fucking, you ready to become a wrestler? Come on down. Let's go. Some Shawnee. Abel in here cooking it up. Cooking it up a nice meal after my long day. Yeah. Some chicks out? Nah. Chicken's done. Take a bite. Take a bite. Take a bite. It's chicken, all right. Good. <laughs> Making some turkey burgers. Sliced sourdough. Sliced, baby. Baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thumbnail. Getting <laughs> <laughs> booty. All right, babe, made me some turkey burgers. Damn, these hoes feel thick and airy. We about to eat some turkey burgers, watch some Ahsoka. Ahsoka. The first episode was like hella 30, 40 minutes of no talking with 20 minutes of commentary. I swear. The first 15 minutes of the show was literally just cinematic shots. The first 15 minutes. It's cool though. I ain't gonna lie, it was kind of dope when she said, Choo! Man. What? Choo! That was when she threw it down in a circle. Uh -oh. Make the little circle. Fair now. Yeah. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe to the channel. Also, if you don't mind, check out people sharing the video. Um, and yeah, catch you guys on the next one. Well, I actually have somebody holding my camera to film. This was like, this was like a, you know, stationary, like, just giving you a glimpse of the dimps without a wimps, you know? So, I got you on the next one, bro. She might got me on the next one, you know. But yeah, peace out, y'all.